Thank you for that profound answer. And I, I will want to touch on something when you talk about lifelong um, learner. And because over, over time, people believe that it is schooling that is education. So I want you to touch more on that, how we can see uh, education broadly beyond just schooling. I would like to hear from you what aspect of education uh, makes it broader. Uh, than just going to school and um, learning mathematics, just like you said, and um, seeing how you can connect that with how education can be so qualitative in itself. Yeah, and I think right here that we really get in touch with different levels of humanity and mm. which education is serving. And that's from the intrapersonal level, starting at the self and having a sense of calm, having a sense of inner peace, knowing yourself, having self-awareness, having tools for managing or regulating yourself, and really finding your relationship with yourself and how you show up in the world. So a quality education starts with those foundations of what is really inner peace and then builds to other levels of humanity like interpersonal. So when we are um, talking with others that we can have differing views and we can still engage in dialogue without violence. Um, really, we start thinking at these next levels of what is in consideration for the, the collective good. And so that moves in our levels of humanity to institutional levels, um, which like here in the United States is formal schooling, but also the cultural levels. You know, you think about okay. um, whether it's youth or, uh, or outside of school, how we depict peace, how we depict violence, uh -huh. and moving that through our different levels of humanity. So really starting at the foundation of the intrapersonal or having a deep self-awareness of knowing who you are and the multifacets and intersections of identity that can exist.